It's time for Ink Flight. This is the Super Sleep Deprivation Let's Get Down to Business edition. Um, I just got home from an epic trip. I will be making a video about it at some point. I've been awake for a long time. So long I can't do the math. But like, this is the current time. What's that say? The 17th. And I woke up at 7 p.m. on the 15th. I'm tired. We aren't here to talk about that. Sorry, like this is where brain goes. Brain don't work so good right now. Come back later. But like, look, I put a hold on my mail. Did I say this already? Look, it's too late. I put a hold on my mail, but this, this was delivered anyway, so how can I not? And I've been avoiding watching all the videos for this. And like, what am I, I can't live my life that way. So let's get down. Let's get down to business. We need some call o ring cards. Boop boop. Oh. Hold on, some cutie just messaged me. Okay. That looks like six. The other day I was trying to like do math for like time and I knew like plus six hours and then I could do plus eight hours, but I couldn't figure out how to get in between because I kind of like forgot about seven. Sleep deprivation is a hell of a drug. Um, I don't recommend it. I tried to sleep. I've dozed, so it's not like I haven't like gotten any rest, but I haven't like actual sleeped. Um, so let's open this. Let's get down, let's get down to business and not share my address. It's been a million minutes. Ooh, hello, hello. Look at this. Okay, let's go. This has words. We have online campus fountain pen, assorted colors. I got this like nice matte, I think it's black. Maybe it's a charcoal. Bully. Um, comes with a cartridge. So if I wanna use it, I'm gonna have to empty the cartridge. Um, and, okay, wait, we were reading this. When most people think of a German fountain pen, they think of pens made by established brands like Lamy, Pelican, Caveco, and Montblanc. Isn't it funny that we all say Montblanc like French, even though it's a German company? Whatever. It doesn't say that on the paper. I just said that out loud. While online pens doesn't have the same recognition, they still make a nice, affordable fountain pen, including this month's box is a smart, stylish campus filler fountain pen from online. Pull off snap cap to reveal an ergonomic... <clears throat> Rubberized grip section and medium point stainless steel nib. View the remaining ink in your pen using transparent ink window between the grip and the barrel. The campus includes one long blue ink cartridge that has an arrow pointing to the end that needs to be inserted into the pen. This pen is also compatible with international ink cartridges or converters, not included. The fit might be a little tight, but it will securely attach. Then we get this sticker which says, uh, this is Octo Vonnegut. I feel like it's not focusing. I can't tell. Octo Vonnegut. So it goes. And then we have the inks. Oh, did I did tell you about supplies. <laughs> Maria, you've told nobody about anything relevant. I have color coloring cards. 
I have a Hobonichi Weeks. I don't know if I'm going to use this, except I've used this every time, so it feels like a sin not to. So I guess I'm going to use this. This is, I don't remember from whom, but it's white Tamoa River paper. And I have a watercolor brush, a dip nib. This is the Zero G in a glass dip pen. And a difficulty getting tape off of this. Um. Oh, they're Sailor! <laughs> I wonder what... I gotta watch Manda's because she's got most of these. Or maybe all of these. At least one of these is, I think, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's not Sound of Rain. So it says, last year, Ink Flight, number 67, visited Sailor in Japan to sample the first year of Mecha Ink series of multi-chromatic fountain pen inks. These colors were so interesting, complex, and fun that we came back for more. The second edition of your Mecha Inks includes... Five mysterious colors that dramatically change their appearance as they dry. To complete the seven samples, we also included two colors from the Shikiori Sounds of Rain collection. Bully. Um, so we've got... I'm excited because I've seen me just watch like all of these. So now I get to see them. So we have Kokoro Guma. Um, Zare Gokoro, this is the Shiko Shikiori Zaza, um, then we have Date Gokoro, the Yurameku one, and we have, you know us, we like to, hey, is that? Sorry, nope. We're still here, Maria. <laughs> Suki Gokoro. I wonder if it's pronounced Suki or if it's pronounced Ski. Um, Hana Gokoro. Hana is one of the numbers, isn't it? Maybe it's Haha. Whatever. And Shito Shito. Wow. Wow, we're doing great. We're staying on topic. My friend Pete were here right now. He would be saying, Maria, go to sleep. But also possibly, hey Maria, you're doing great. Thanks for that, Pete. Okay, so... You know, the sad thing about the order they put it in is, like, they have some of the darkest ones first. I could do it in any order, but that feels, like, chaotic. Ooh. Hi. <laughs> what one was this? It should be Kokoro Guma. This one feels uh, dense. Look at how it coats. Um, so I put up a video of the stuff I would be bringing on my trip. Y'all, I don't tell the internet when I'm going to be gone. So I was 
already on my way home when that video was live. Um, but I appreciate all the advice people were giving me. Um, although I should still be at my, in Sicily right now, but things didn't work out that way. What happened? You'll have to watch the video, won't you? <laughs> oh, I didn't write it over here. Well, that's fine. So about this ink, it says... In the vial, this ink looks blue. Once you put it to paper, it transforms into a sheening brownish violet. Wow. I looked away and it was a, and it's a different color. <laughs> I missed it. I missed it. I'm going to have to watch the replay. <laughs> Y'all saw it. Let's watch it here. We can zoom in here. Zoom in. I missed it again. <laughs> it's fine. I liked it better before it changed colors. Nobody's surprised, right? Let's get a pen. I think this is me. I don't usually write this now. I'm just gonna write them here. So I don't have any inked fountain pens right now. I wrote them dry. Crazy, right? So I've got to ink some pens, obviously. I'm getting. Oh, I didn't. I didn't do it on the other paper. It's okay. Maria, you're giving yourself grace. You're tired, even though, quite frankly, you'd have made this mistake even if you weren't. Okay, I'm watching it. And it's not changing yet. I think the lighting is not good. Okay, I put a light right overhead. It's the best I can do. Next up, Zare Gokoro. This dusky blue-black ink has a rich coppery sheen. Oh, 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 yes, yes. Okay. What was this? Sare Gokuro. I hate the letter Z. In, in writing. I should practice it and then I won't hate it.
Because, like, what the hell is that? Oh. What the hell is that that you can't even see? Ugh. Sorry, it happens. It happens sometimes, okay? And it happened then. Do better, Maria. Yeah. Sailor, you're a Meku. Looks like you're a Mekru. I don't know. Who cares? We'll do this over here. Sailor, you're a Meku. I don't think you saw me writing that. Maybe I should just zoom back out. This is the problem. We try to zoom in. It fails us. Lesson learned. Never try. It's just maybe we move things a little. Maybe that's a good idea. Yeah. Okay. It's good. It's good. Brush. Oh, the color that this is. Oh, hello. I didn't put very much on there. It's beautiful. Whoa, whoa, and then it... too much ink on here it's hard though you can get as much as you get unless you pay attention so I also have to think about currently inked I kind of want to do that right now, but I think realistically I should wait until my brain is a little more awake. Um, the first thing I do, you know, when I get home from a trip is, like, take a shower, of course, because you have, like, airport grad all over you. And um, then I was like, you know what I should do is cut my hair. And I managed to convince myself that I should actually probably wait until I've had more sleep to do that. So... That's one of my wins for today. I only cut it a little. <laughs> okay, so we here have Shikiori Zatza. Um, Zatza is the sound of hard rain. Ooh, man, there was some, there was some hard rain in uh, Catania yesterday. Yeah, whenever I left. Um, it was great. I love rain. Well, you know, I love like those storms where it's like, the feels like the world is ending, but only for like five minutes. And only if the world doesn't actually end. it I guess that's a thing so those of you watching this I'm I'm really sorry about the disjointed nature of everything do you have any of these inks have you used any of them um you know 
or any on your I gotta get this ink list Zaza makes me think of Zsa Zsa, Zsa Gabor I think she used to be on Hollywood Squares. Oh, oh hello. Boom, 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 boom. Immediately, hello, I love you by the doors. Goes into my head. Because look at it. Medium blue with shading. I mean, it's so pretty. Oh, such a sucker for blue. Oh, we're reaching a level of, um, oh, I feel a little bit like I'm floating. So I probably can't go to the store like I hope to. I was going to walk for the record because I don't think I'm safe to drive. They've done studies on sleep deprivation and how... It doesn't take much sleep deprivation to be equivalent to actually a whole lot of drinks. <laughs> a whole lot of alcoholic drinks. Okay, I did all the things with this one. So far, this is the one. I think the... I wonder if I'm like moving a lot or if it just feels like the world is moving. Here's Date Gokoro. For the record, I haven't like tried to take anything to stay awake. I don't think that's a good idea. I just failed to sleep. Okay. I keep I'm dipping this too much. Oof, too much ink on there. I forgot how much I hate writing on these cards with this nib. So my plan for today was to like work on sewing things. But you know what? I think that's a good way to waste fabric. I'm pretty sure nothing. You know what I could do though? I'll see if I have to print out my pattern and I can do that. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for the conversation, everyone. Sailor. You're a Mecca. At the heart of this ink is a deep violet with red sheen. What's at the brain of this ink? Or the liver? very indigo when it goes down. That's pretty. Does Amanda own this one? This feels like Amanda color. I like it. Daisuke this. <laughs> yeah, good enough. <laughs> yeah. 
I might not be able to stay awake as long as I had hoped. <laughs> I might be dying. <laughs> Next step is seeking cocoa. Mrs. says this muddy green ink has tones of olive with reddish brown sheen. This seems like not one for me. Okay. Suki Gokoro, I'm going to have to change my method, I think, which I don't like because I've done all of them this way. But I can't. This, this, this new paper, this new stock is awful for dip. Oh, we got water in there. It's so pretty. It goes down an incredible deal. Just incredible. But it's already changing. Wait. It might match my sweatshirt. Yeah, it's a pretty good match. I'm overheated. I don't know why. I, it, sweats just seem like the most comfy clothes I could possibly wear, which is what I needed. But... These inks are just fun to play with. They're fun to write with too. Like if you're the type, if you do the kind of writing where you might like think about it, you know, so you like write and you think and you write and you think. Th these kinds of inks are fun to write with because you, while you're doing the thinking part of your writing, they're changing colors. So you get to watch it. Uh, next. Our pin ultimate <laughs> is Hana Gokuro. This grayish slate purple contains deep reflections of burgundy sheen. Sounds like this could be lovely. I didn't do the writing with this fine. I will later. Still a lot on there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That worked out okay.
Um, I hope that tomorrow will be a productive day for me because like I need to make some clothes. Have a party this weekend. Well, it's a party, it's a get together. It's a hang out and eat food and drink. Um, kind of thing. I'm really looking forward to. I haven't seen this group of people in quite a long time. But I have very few clothes that fit me. You know, great problem to have for me. This is a measurement of success. But, um,. Okay, so right now, the Tsuki Gokuro looks amazing on the Tamoa River paper. Can't wait to get up close and personal with that one with you. For that one with you. With that one for you. With that one for you. Oh, we didn't do it on here, though. Did we? Wait, one, two, three, four, five. We did. We did. You did, Maria. We're in flow state. Um, I don't get grayish slate purple from that. And our last ink is Shito Shito. The sound of rain softly falling. Shito Shito exhibits a watery light aqua blue that shades beautifully. I'm thinking of writing down the story of how my trip went. But I can't decide if I want to do that like as a memoir type thing or if I want to try and do it as like, you know, a story like and I pretend it happened to someone else. If you have thoughts on that, go ahead and leave a comment. Will you leave a comment whether you want to or not? I mean, wait, no. <laughs> you will leave a comment. You mean, you leave a comment on whatever you want. Or don't. You know? This color is pretty. Like, really pretty. Maybe I'll put this in my Italian pen. <laughs> I didn't buy any pens on my trip. Even though I intended to. Or I, you know, I considered it. And then captured my heart. I also only saw some, a few. This reminds me of my Perth Kernel Cove that I like, but like greener. Yeah, I think that's right. Cool. Okay. Can you see how dope this is? So here they all are on the Hobonichi Weeks. And except for this, I used the dip, the glass pen to write with them. We gotta, uh, this one is so complex and wonderful in this swatch. And look at what happened when it got wet. That's neat. If I just look at the writing over here, I, of course, like Zaza. I like Date Gokoro. 
I do like Hanagokoro and Shito Shito. Well, okay, I like all of them. Yeah, that's the better way to put it. Which ones do you like, Maria? All of them. Okay. And now we can line them up. And look at them on the coloring cards. Maria's making a mess. I'm going to tell. There, it's perfect. So, on these coloring cards, I like Zaza, Date Gokuro, and Shito Shito. I don't like the rest. I mean, they're okay, but, like, they don't sing to my heart. Which is what inks normally do. And then... We have... On the white... Tomorrow River paper... This is that Suki Gokuro. It's really, really neat. So on this, I don't like these first two that are sort of super sheeners. The Date Gokuro is a super highly sheening in this swatch, but I don't see it being that way in the writing, so I think I'd like that. Shito Shito is just my jam. It's so pretty and soft. Um, and this pen. I should do a current... I should ink this. And use it this month. I mean, this isn't like an expensive pen, but the clip feels nice. It's got a sort of... They, they call it an ergonomic grip. Think of it as a triangular grip, but like way more subtle than a Lamy. Size-wise, I like it. The cap isn't super postable. It doesn't want to stay on my pinky. Yeah. Cool. So this was our ink flight. I'm pretty pleased. I'm glad I got to do this. Now I think because um, the world is moving a little, I'm going to end this here and maybe lay down. <laughs> I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care. Bye.